Then in Lullaby, Lullaby, um, I still think it's good to practice that bar seven. Okay, and then with the two hands, so you must leave the thumb down firmly. start your practice with those two bars then take it from the bar before bar six so that means your right hand will be on three and the left hand will be on two and four so from bar six one two three four five so a little lift and just get your fingers in place One, two, three, one, two, three. Either the counting is fine. Then the next two bars, just go through them first hand separately and then try them together. So I'm starting with my two in my right hand on F sharp. Three to G, E. Now still a little bit hesitant finding that chord. Okay, so make sure you're going from E up to C, that's the interval, it's six notes apart, thumb to five, but E to C, because if you overstretch and end up on the wrong note, it throws the whole bar out, that bar 10. So just make sure you're going up to C and then add the little note underneath, one and four over to two and three, you did get that, okay? Just watch your counting, two, three, one, two, Three, one, two, three, one, two, three, okay? Then try it hands together. So you notice I haven't played from the beginning at all yet. I'm just dealing with certain parts of the music and I would do that when you practice as well. So together from bar nine. and make sure the D is there in the left hand. Let's do those two bars again. Listen also to the counting. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then you're going to just do two more bars hands separately. So I'll do the left hand. It's a very similar start to the bar we've just been playing. Same counting, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, just listen to that again. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Right hand starting on A with a two, and again, between this bar, which is bar 11 and bar 12, you've got a, quite a stretch there. So just have a look at that before you do it or play it. So you're going from G up to F natural. So that's a seventh, that's seven notes apart. And it's a bit of a stretch. We're not using the five because we need the five to play the G further on. So it's got to be one to four. So make sure you've looked at the keyboard and got those two notes in sight okay so now i'm going to play from bar 11 one two three one two three stretch to f two three one two three and i'll just go on to the first note of the next bar let me do that right hand again one two three one two three one two three one, two, three, one, two, 